I'll give you guys a uh, update on the 91 Chevy Caprice project here. Everything is basically put back together on the unit. And I uh, priced new bumper covers for the car. It turned out they were a little too steep for the pocketbook currently, so I just went ahead and painted the current ones that I had and uh, placed them on the vehicle. You can tell here that, yeah, this is the main reason why I didn't want to put them back on, but uh, price-wise, they kind of had to. So, same goes for the back one. The back one wasn't bad, but I still wanted to replace it anyway. And uh, as we can see here, it doesn't look too, too bad. You get the trim molding uh, back inside the bumper, and it wouldn't be too, too bad. Uh, the vehicle, I don't intend on driving it anywhere this year, so, uh, well, it'll be good enough for now. Valve stem is leaking on this tire. I found and figured that out where it is leaking. So, you know, of course, after about a week, it goes flat. So, um, the door panels still have to be put back on. Uh, I cleaned the door jams. The paint is actually uh, pretty close to the original. Uh, it matches fairly nicely. And, um, yeah, so, I mean, it's very hot today, so actually I should roll down the windows. There's no battery in it, so I'm not going to start it for you guys. Um, I don't think there's a battery in it. Not by the look of it. Anyway. Um, so yeah. Uh, door panels are slowly coming back together on it. I want to replace the speakers. This back door, this back window actually does not operate at all. It doesn't work. So um, that's why I haven't put that one back on. I don't want to do things twice. So I'm just going to order some new uh, new parts, new speakers, a new window motor. And get them everything all functioning before I put everything back together. But uh, it is good as is. Except for the exhaust. I do need to get a new um, crossover pipe. Actually, technically, it should get a whole new exhaust system put on it. Um, so anyway, the tires, I'm not using these tires. That's why there's overspray on them, in case anybody was wondering. Um, yeah. So same same deal. Nothing, nothing put back together here. Uh, it's the same, uh, yeah, same as it was for the longest time. Um, I'm going to go find a designated spot to park it. I just kind of had it on display here in front of the property. Um, yeah, just to kind of kind of show the work that I can do. I'm kind of proud of my uh, workmanship. Uh, you know, it may not be the greatest, uh, but whatever. You know, it's, it's silver. It's got to shine. That's all that matters. So, yeah, not much else to say about the old girl. It is painted. It's... It's pretty well back together. The taillights and everything are back in it. That's why I wanted to put the bumpers back on the vehicle because I did not want to uh, leave the vehicle all tore apart for the summer while I waited to get bumpers for it. So I just said, you know what, I'm just going to put the old ones on. And who knows, they might stay like that for a very long time. I want to order a new grill because that is cheap. It's only about $35 ordered from the States. So I probably will order a new grill for the unit. Uh, when that happens, I have no idea. But it's good enough for now. There's no doubt about that. So, yeah, white wall tires with wheel discs. I need a new windshield. I have to put one in. There is a split here. So it, it won't pass anymore. It actually, um, over time, there, it was split here when I removed the molding that was here. And it just ended up, you know, going right down the side of the car. The windshield is pitted actually as a matter of fact too, so that's another reason why I don't want it to be left on the vehicle. So um, yeah, once the trim goes back on the vehicle, it'll look pretty d decent. It is dirty right now, it is pollen season of course, so you know, uh, the buds are growing on the trees and everybody who drives down the road here is making dust, And um, but it is, it is what it is. But uh, so far it's stayed relatively clean considering it's been sitting here at this exact location for the last week and a half. But, uh, oh well, we'll see how it goes. I might, uh, I might pull it over there um, and park another vehicle here just to put on display, so to speak. But anyway, that's all that for the old girl. I need a map sensor. I've uh, figured that out. I need a new map sensor for the old girl too. Make it run better in an exhaust system. And, there's a bit of a problem with the brakes. The brake light is on. It's not leaking, but it, it needs a brake job somewhere along the lines. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Take care of yourselves.